show off. This is a dual Cerakoted biohazard build. Uh, we did this in uh, OD green and copper. So uh, OD green case, um, biohazard engraved on the side here. Uh, we did dual Cerakote on the uh, dial itself. So um, uh, basically do the whole dial in copper bake it do the whole dial in uh, OD green and then let it dry some and then lightly sand off the green from the raised biohazard logo and then bake it to lock in that lower area so then we pipped it uh, the wife did some custom uh, hands uh, we painted them out brass and green um, and then loomed them also loomed the dial uh, the bezel itself, as well as the SS band, is in dual Cerakote. So, do the whole uh, bezel in copper, then do green, you know, bake it, and then do green, so that the green is down in there, and then lightly sand off all the green from the top, then bake it. So, that's how we do the dual Cerakote there. Um, copper Cerakoted uh, crown with the biohazard logo there as well and then we did um, the SS band so it's a lot of taping off you do one set and do the other and I need my canned air is it even handy that's handy so uh, dual Cerakote here on the uh, clasp as well so biohazard logo there my logo there and then we did the fold over keeper uh, in the other. So uh, that is the build as a whole. Uh, low profile exhibition case back on it, stainless steel movement holder in there, and a gilded rotor. So now I can say that's the build as a whole. So those are all the pieces there. So uh, cool custom dual Cerakote build, um, and it could be yours. Maybe it will be yours. If it is, congrats on your win. Uh, this is a future build uh, that's going to be in, I'm sorry, it's a build. It's not a future build. It's a build right now. But it's going to go in a future event, either a Powerball or a Waffle on my page. So if it's going to you, congrats. Um, appreciate your support, and you're getting a pretty killer watch. This is an awesome color combination. So um, bezel on these will turn left. They'll turn right. I put them on as tight as I can so that they don't move around too much. Um, Non-clickable bezels. Automatic mechanical, so you can wind it, you can wear it, you can put it in a watch winder, but if it's dead or you're not going to be very active, make sure you wind it just a little bit. Now you do that as you back the crown off the threads till you hear it clicking. At that point, you can wind, and a wind is a turn that way. Turning it back towards you doesn't do anything, but it's a lot easier to just go back and forth. It doesn't hurt it to come back towards you. Do this for four or five seconds before you put it on. Even if you're not very active, you will keep time throughout the day, and if you do it for something closer to 20 seconds, you're going to max out your 31 plus hour power reserve on it. You cannot overwind it. You can wind it all day if you like. It does not have a hacking movement, so when you pull it to the one and only click, you'll notice it keeps going. You'll also notice you got a wobble crown in there. It deflects the lateral pressure from going into the stem and into the movement. So, if you don't like it, just don't push and pry on it. You, it's, it's there to protect you and your fumblings around. So, just pull it, pull it a little tight if you want. Okay, Google, what time is it? Okay, Google. What time is it? It's 1.46 p.m. 1.46 p.m. Set your time. Push it back over, taking it out of that wind, or I'm sorry, that time setting, and then screw it down. And there you go. There's your build. As with every build, you get matching beads entirely up to you whether you wear them or not. And then this is going to come in a nice brown biohazard box, special edition box. And as with every build, actually, I'm going to put this away real quick get it out of my way. As with every boat, you're going to get watch clearance is good on all glass and metal parts to so that watch as a whole. Non-streaking, non-toxic, non-residue. You're also going to get some fine scratch remover. This is Novus 2 from Amazon. Of course, I forgot one part. I was packing away a guy's watch who's on his way to pick it up right now. Um, that's Novus 2 from Amazon. It's basically the same thing as Poly Watch. You can scratch this acrylic glass. Um, if you do, no big deal. Put a tiny bit of this on it. Buff against that scratch, filling that scratch, using your included microfiber. Um, 
don't go with the scratch or you're wiping it right back out. So buff it for about 20 seconds using your included microfiber and you will knock that scratch out. So uh, if you want me to build you something, custom and unique, reach out and I'll see what I can do. And if you want to continue to see videos like this in the future, like and subscribe as I put them up all the time. Appreciate your time, guys.